Hi there guys, it's Chris C with SelfMadeUB.com. Welcome to this Traffic Bots review. So here I am on the sales page of Traffic Bots. It says the ultimate all-in-one cloud-based app allows marketers to have their own personal Facebook autoresponder and built-in traffic machine. Today we're going to take a deep dive into it. We're going to see what it's all about, what it can deliver. So before we get into that, it really helps out the channel if you drop a like on this video. Hit subscribe and turn on that bell if you want to be updated with new videos coming out like this all the time that are going to help you to find success online. Also, if at any moment during this video you just want to click off, do make sure you first click on the green check mark in the description. Go to that timestamp because I have something for you there that I think you might find interesting. All right, so first off, know that ProfitBots is being launched on Warrior Plus. That network is fairly notorious for having products on there that are like get-rich-quick schemes, push-button systems, scams, and things of that nature. So do be wary of that as we go through this video. Um, a lot of the products on there are created and market to, marketed to people who are known to have what is called shiny object syndrome. Uh, so we're going to look into that as we go through the video. Also know that most of the videos surrounding mine, these people are financially incentivized to promote profit bots um, by enticing you with bonuses and things like that. But do note these people are not using profit bots. They're simply wanting you to click on their affiliate link so they can make a commission. So do be wary of the motivations behind those channels. So now that you have more of an open mind and you know a little bit more of what's going on in the background, uh, let's see if we can't give this an honest review. I do have access to ProfitBots, but I did find myself kind of fumbling around with it. And so the creators also have a demo video of them going through it. So uh, I think together we can go through their demo video. Obviously they can make their demo video look really, really great. But uh, let's see if we can't also give it an honest assessment as we go through it together. So ProfitBots in a nutshell is essentially um, it's going to hook up with your Facebook and Instagram and, and from inside ProfitBots, it's going to allow you to post different kinds of posts on Facebook. Um, and there's also a bot, a messenger bot. So if somebody types in, if someone messages you on Facebook and they're like, hi, uh, your bot can like, you can set up your bot to reply and say, hey, um, are you struggling? Uh, with making money online or whatever and it can kind of like you can set it up I guess to pick up on keywords um, And it also has a couple of other tidbits like site comparisons compare your site with other sites and things of that nature So let's jump jump in and uh, see you know uh, the functionality in full your Facebook account and then that's it if we quickly look over the test page I made right here we can see all there is to know about it, including a test I made with profit bots. Now, so you're essentially you can post on Facebook uh, via profit bots. I'm not seeing how that's useful. You could just go to Facebook and post, but let's continue. Let's quickly go through all of the amazing features of this app. You can integrate any social media account you want. So you can directly upload onto your Facebook page. You can integrate any email autoresponder that you're using and even any SMS API or email API. So you can have full control over your own Facebook account and your subscribers. Here, you can manage all of the comments that are made on your posts. So you can put in different keywords and replies that will automatically be done by profit bots. You Okay, so it's kind of an all-in-one dashboard. So if you want to post to LinkedIn and Facebook and Instagram all at the same time, you can come to ProfitBots and it will just blast it out and you can save yourself, you know, a good 15 seconds. Um, it also has these replying bots. So if someone likes your image or if someone comments, it'll pick up on that and it'll automatically reply to them saying, hey, thanks for commenting. Um, I'm not a fan of non-authentic uh, engagement on social media. I've tested it and uh, real engagement is always best. So this seems like it might be kind of cool and fun and you know easy, um, but real engagement is always best and you should be engaging genuinely with your audience. That really matters. You can manage all of your subscribers right here. Currently, we don't have any subscribers and you can message them. You can expect their email from their account. So you can start mailing them, messaging them, doing anything you want, having full control over your own subscribers. Here we have the live 
okay? Uh, it's weird the way he's using subscribers there. Um, if you do integrate it with Facebook, that doesn't mean to say you're getting the emails of the people on your Facebook. Um, so I'm not sure if he's talking about Facebook subscribers, which is not the real, it's not the actual term people use on Facebook. So maybe control over your email subscribers. Chat, which is mostly going to be handled by our bot. So our bot is going to be talking with your client, with your subscribers using the texts that you're going to be creating. And if they need a human agent, they can say, I need a human agent. And you're going to be getting a message directly into ProfitBots that one of your subscribers is looking for human interaction. Here is where the magic happens. Most people are looking for human interaction. Messenger bots, I've seen people use them to good effect, but these people are like big time marketers and they just have it as a supplementary thing on their Facebook. Uh, you can tell it's a bot straight away. Um, it might be good for something like an FAQ. If you, if you don't already have traffic on your Facebook, then it's pretty much pointless because no one's really gonna be trying to chat with you. Um, if you're running ads and sending a huge influx of traffic, paid traffic to your profile, maybe uh, could be useful. So we can create our own bot exactly like we want. So we can create a flow with our drag and drop flow builder right here. So whenever someone subscribes to our page, for example, we can send them a text and then directly afterwards, if we're going to wait for a reply, we can send them an action button and then we can continue so on and so forth until we create the perfect conversation that we want our bot to have with our client. You can manage this however you want. You can edit this flow make sure your page is as customized and as personalized as possible. And of course, we can mess around with the keywords that your bot is going to be looking for. You can set up different welcome messages and icebreakers to get a almost human conversation going with your subscribers. You can mess around with different general settings, including with your own API integrations. So you can add the emails of your subscribers directly into your apps. Of course, action button settings, if you want to create different objectives for them to reach and so much more to make sure your clients have a quality time on your account. This, the thing with the messenger bot is while it could fill in a lot of cracks, stop you from missing uh, traffic a little bit. I do feel like the chat bot in uh, ProfitBot is a little bit limited. The one I used was this one here, messenger bot. So I'll put a link in the description you can, you can get a free trial for that if you want and check out using a messenger bot that has a little bit more, obviously it's only a messenger bot, so they're fully focused in on making it as good as possible. If you are wanting to get into messenger bots, uh, I'll put a link for that in the description. Then we can have broadcasting to directly broadcast a message to all of your subscribers on Facebook. And then of course we can do different posts for our Facebook account. So let's just quickly do so mass broadcasting on Facebook, uh, you can create groups within Facebook and do that as well. Um, I guess if you've got a huge list and you don't want to create the group, take the 10 minutes to create the group, you could, that could be useful, I guess. A text post. You can see I've already done one, but let's do another one. So right here, I'm not going to go with anything too complicated so we can see how it's going to look right here and we can already type it so i'm going to select my page here i'm going to say welcome to profit quotes and we can see how it's going to look we can give it a name oh he's just posting it to his facebook page okay okay you could just do that on facebook but welcome okay. and then of course we can set a different time for it however we need and I'm just going to click on submit. And then you can see it has been done almost instantly. And if we go to our page right now and reload here, done. I don't see why you wouldn't just do that and just go to Facebook and do it. Like you can do it on the app on your phone. You don't have to open up profit bots and you know, do the extra step. I don't get it. You can see it has been published and it is ready to be interacted with by your subscribers. Now, if you have any. 
Of course, these posts can have links, images, videos. You can do carousels, you can... Okay, you can do all of this inside Facebook. So it's... I get it having the one... Um, the one-stop shop for all your social medias. Like you can make message, blast it to LinkedIn, blast it to Facebook, blast it to Twitter. I wouldn't recommend that because there's almost like a different way to communicate on each platform. You might make a post on Twitter in a certain way, certain style, and that might not get the same reaction on Twitter, uh, sorry, on Instagram or Facebook. Each social media platform kind of has its own language and its own style. So I wouldn't recommend blasting to multiple platforms, really. You can even compare your website with the competitors to know exactly what needs to be done to improve your engagement and give you the perfect edge you need to have over your competitors. Now, okay, if you compare websites with a competitor, I don't know what information that that can give you that can make you know what you need to do that they're doing. Obviously, you'd have to really just look at their site. Maybe they're producing a content more often. Maybe they're, they've got more of a social media following. Um, but if you find that out, it's not like you can just automatically do that. So let's see where he's going with this. So for example, if we're going to compare TikTok with Twitter, we can see okay. all of the shares, reactions and comments these two websites are getting on a daily basis. This is a, an extremely good example of how you can get the edge over your competitor for you. Okay, all right, so let's say I'm, okay, so Twitter's getting like uh, 6.52 million shares, TikTok's getting 11, it's almost double. So this is a really good example. So let's say I'm the CEO of Twitter and I put, and I compare myself with TikTok, he's saying, I'll know exactly what to do. No, I can just see a bunch of numbers. <laughs> you know, it's not gonna present me with what I need to do in order to become TikTok. That's a little bit silly. <laughs> I'm not sure where he was going with that. For example, you were the owner of TikTok. ProfitBots allows you to handle your page. And he just switched, he just stopped talking. Say that again. You can get the edge over your competitor. For example, you were the owner of TikTok. ProfitBots allows you to handle your page. If I was the owner of TikTok, what? Don't know where he was going with that. On autopilot by setting our bot one time and then letting it do its job forever. Thank you. So what he means by that is you set up the bot with your automatic chat bot. Uh, and that'll just reply to people who type in certain keywords. Okay, I can, I'm, I'm hip to that a little bit. And it can auto reply to comments and things like that. Everything else, I'm not feeling. I'm not even feeling the automatically generated um, engagement with your audience. It's not gonna help you um, to you know, get more engagement, not on Facebook. Um, you should be genuinely engaging with your audience. Uh, so I'm not, down with that. The chat bot is, a, is okay. I think a lot of people can make use of that. Not beginners though, definitely not beginners. And I'd also use a better chat bot, okay? Like a um, messenger bot top app. Um, so currently the sales page is not really up, so we can't see. Um, one thing I don't like is how when people release a product, like they could have just made this a messenger bot and said, look at our messenger bot. I mean, look how messenger, like messengerbot.app, right? They just say, hey, look, this is our messenger bot. This is what it does. These are all the features. You can look up analytics. You can do all this kind of stuff. And then, you know, done for you templates. And that's it. And then they're like, okay, do you want it? Okay. And what they've done is they've, they've made it about making money. Okay. So then I have to critique it based on that as well. Are you gonna make money with this? Probably not. This is probably not what you need. This is not needed for 99.9% .9 of people. Do chat box work? Yeah, maybe. But if you're getting, more so if you're getting huge influxes of traffic to your social media and you don't wanna lose those people, you wanna try and capture them, then maybe you try to get them into your bot and see if you can capture an email or two here and there. For beginners, this is not gonna help you. Blasting out, you know, posts on social media via this, 
you can just do it on social media. Just do it on Facebook. If you want to post on Facebook, post on Facebook. If you want to post on Twitter, post on Twitter. You don't need this to do that. The website comparison thing was a joke, <laughs> pretty much. I did not get that. Um, and the auto commenting, auto replying, again, you should engage genuinely. And if they just said, this is what it does, you know, this is a thing we've created, this is what it does, fine. But they've made it about profit. Like you're gonna make money from this and you're not. Another thing I don't like is this huge funnel that they have in place. So the front end is $17. They'll probably market to you as $17, but there's all these hidden extras uh, that'll just pop up on your screen as you are buying, trying to buy it. If you do wanna buy it, I wouldn't buy it. So there's upgrade number one, 36, upgrade number two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight upgrades. So just pretty ridiculous, really. This is just put in place to work on the cognitive bias called the commitment consistency bias that says your brain likes momentum and once you say yes to one thing, you're more likely to keep saying yes. So rather than spending 17, when the credit card's in your hand and you're buying it anyway, you're more likely to you know, get at least one of the upgrades so they can extract as much money from you as possible. So with these funnels like this that are completely hidden from you on the sales page, just a huge red flag there as well. This is not gonna make you any money, especially if you're a beginner. I think this is targeting people with shiny object syndrome. Um, and I think a lot of you people out there, you know, maybe you do have shiny object syndrome, but most of you, I think you're just looking for a way to, you know, do something that works, okay? So if that is you, if you are serious about building a business online and making money online, I do have a link for you in the description that you can click on. It will take you through to another page where I explain to you my Silver Spoon program that you can get involved in. There are a couple of free spots left, not many. Uh, where you can get started for free and also join my community for free. So if you are serious, do claim one of those spots. If you're not that serious, do let the people who are get in and claim those last couple of spots. And on the next page, I'll take you through the whole process step by step on what you need to do to build something that actually works, okay? If you found value in this video, drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.